Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother. So, today, we're going to be working on we're the cord, getting rid of some stuff, adding some stuff, and that means we're adding some boost to it. So, I've got the intercooler here, got all my intercooler piping and stuff, got the manifold got here. Got the turbo right we're there. Gonna just start tearing everything apart and start just boost it again, I guess. I mean, that's really it. So, let's get it going. Alright guys, so a little bit of an manifold update. Manifold off and the downpipe off right here. Turbo manifold on the car now. Put it all up. And then we'll bolt the turbo we'll on. The fittings right here yeah. for it. So we're just going to keep on going. See how Alright guys, so we got all the new fittings and everything on the turbo. Our TV. skates mounted um, up. We're going to notch this here a little bit. So the turbo can clear it. Right here. Just notched. So the turbo can sit all down right, in so here. <clears throat> we got the turbo on. The oil return line is connected. We're doing the oil feed right now. I got to get hardware for the turbo to bolt back to the manifold. I don't know where mine went, so I'm gonna go get. I got to get some of those. We're gonna put the oil feed in, so the oil lines are done. The, this will be all set up. Then we got to put the intercooler on, piping and all that stuff still, but that won't get done right now. I at least just want to get this part done. So we're gonna get the oil lines on and the turbo bolted up. And then tomorrow or sign I'll do intercooler, intercooler piping, and down pipe. Alright guys, so got the oil lines on, turbo's all bolted on, um, thread sealants on all the fittings, RTV's on here, everything's all snug, tight. I gotta do gotta connect the wastegate line to the and all that stuff still. <clears throat> um Going to start mocking up intercooler, intercooler, and then intercooler piping and everything. Get all put on the car and everything. I'm going to flush, I'm going to drain this oil out of the motor and put fresh oil and right, filter guys, and so everything in as well. Alright guys, stop at O'Reilly's before they closed. Got new plugs. And I was missing a couple clamps that I needed, so I bought some more clamps. So It's we'll already dark out. Finish this um, up. I got a lot more done. The intercooler's all connected and everything. I just got to put some clamps on. So that's pretty much it. Um, when I get back to the house, I'll show you guys how everything looks. Alright guys, so the car is pretty much all put together. Um, opening up the ECU now, so I just put my, um, turbo tune in. My chip that chip in it. was tuned. It's in. Turbo. Put the cover back on, plug it in, and take the car for a ride. Alright guys, so, the turbo's on. All the intercooler piping is on. Intercooler's mounted and everything. I'm gonna swap injectors right now. And as you can see, it's daylight out the next day. So <clears throat> I'm gonna pull the fuel rail and everything off, swap over to my new injectors, and then put the ECU on and everything, and then go make some boost. And I gotta modify the downpipe still. All right, guys. So got the injectors all swapped over. And we got the ECU. Now in. we're gonna start it. Maybe. Alright guys, for some reason when I plug in my P28, the car's not getting fuel, I plug in the stock ECU, it starts right up. Well, it doesn't stay running because the injectors are bigger. I think my issue's right in but there. I think there's some corrosion on there. So, <clears throat> I'm going to go to the parts store or something and see if I can find something that can clean this up without damaging anything. Five and running, guys. My van is not hooked there right now, so we gotta do the downpipe. That's why the car is loud. Just wanna show you guys it's running. I'm gonna let it cool down, build the downpipe for it, and then we'll go for a test drive. And only reason why I wanna build a downpipe before As you go can see, for a test drive the exhaust is. sprays right onto this. And I don't want it to melt my harness for my alternator or anything. As you can see, just idled and it already made it all dirty. So I'm gonna let it cool down. And start building. Alright, guys, so we're driving the Accord. Thank you, Boost. Just running a little lean. Um, obviously, it's a bigger turbo and stuff, so gotta be retuned. So I'm not gonna really beat on it or anything. Just showing you guys that it runs. I just picked up some more oil with it and some coolant. So, driving it. Runs. So, um, when I 
get on the main road. I'll give you guys a small little pull. I just gotta pay attention to my AFR so I don't wanna lean out. So, see you guys here in a second. So the cord is all done together. Um, I gotta trim the bumper a little bit for this intercooler. But we're gonna go to Mexico and do some pulls on it and let you guys see how she pulls and stuff like that. We're gonna get some outside footage.